Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to the channel. So today I'm going to be washing some clothes in this mobile washing machine. As they call it, the mobile washing bag. I'm going to try to do this quick because it's supposed to rain. So yeah, I've used this once or twice before, but I want to um, do it on camera to show you guys how how it's used and everything. So yeah, let's get right into it. The instructions right on the bag, which is handy. So how this works is that it has little ridges inside. As you can see it. There's little ridges inside, so whenever we go like that, we have to press down on it, and that's supposed to agitate the clothes to clean it, so. So first things first, we're gonna add the clothes, so. Okay, now we're gonna add the, the water. Oh, I'm gonna stand up. Hopefully I have enough in here, I don't know. I think that should be enough water. Yeah, this is enough water. Now I'm going to add some detergent, so this is some homemade detergent. I'll leave the link of how I made it down in the description if you want. Okay, so now the instruction says to roll, roll and clip. I don't know which way to clip. Okay, I figured it would be this way. So roll and clip like that. So I'm going to go ahead and use this to deflate. So if I deflate too much, there's the water's gonna come out a little bit. So I think this is good. I'm gonna go ahead and tighten this. And now we start the fun part, <laughs> kinda. Start the washing portion. So it says to rub for 30 seconds to three minutes. So since it's not a lot of clothes, I think a minute should be fine. Oh yeah, you can see the water kinda looking really milky. Should be good enough. Now we're gonna go ahead and untwist and we have to pretty much take out this water, put in some clean water, rinse it, and then it should be good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I went ahead, took out the soapy water and put in some clean water now and um, I guess we just have to rinse it. So let's do that. Okay, now I'm gonna take out this water. This water is very soapy now. And I'm gonna go ahead and take it out. So the water came out like extremely soapy when I uh, rinsed it in the bag. So I went in the house and I ran it under some water to make sure I got all the soap out. Um, so now I'm just going to go ahead and squeeze and make sure I get all the water out completely. I'm going to do it over here. So all the clothes are squeezed and rinsed and um, now I'm just going to hang it up for it to dry and I'll come back with my final thoughts when all that is done. All right, so all finished. The clothes are pretty dry for the most part, as you can see. They're still a little bit wet because um, I hung them out to dry outside and then it started raining, so I had to like run and grab them and bring them inside. But otherwise, it's drying pretty nicely. My thoughts on this mobile, mobile washer is this is really comparable to like washing your clothes in like a bucket, you know, and scrubbing the old fashioned way. But this is a lot more, I guess, stealthy, like, I mean, imagine going to a hotel with a bucket, you know, you can easily fold this up and put this in your suitcase and nobody would ever know. Great for a hotel or if you're in the middle of the woods, like an off-grid situation um, and you don't have like a ton, ton of clothes, this is actually a great option. Just make sure you have enough water to um, rinse away all the soapiness and then you're good. But yeah, it's pretty cool, like, you know, um, folding it over, clipping it and like rubbing it down. If you have kids, that's probably like a perfect job for them. So yeah, fun little tool for like an alternative washing bag, washing machine. Click here if you want to see the off-grid solar cooking video I did. Um, I think it turned out really cool. I cooked a whole meal just by using the sun. Other than that, this channel is dedicated to simple living, minimalism, healthy recipes, lifestyle videos, things like that, and also like some off-grid things. So subscribe and like if you're interested in more content like that. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, God bless.